Well, the rain didn't keep hundreds of neighbors in Ponderay County from meeting Senator Maria Cantwell today. The senator made an appearance at the Krog Family Barbecue earlier this evening. As KXLY 4's Annie Bishop explains, health care reform was just one of many issues on the menu. Over burgers, potato salad, and fresh corn on the cob, hundreds of neighbors talk politics, jobs, and how to improve the economy. We have a lot of problems. We've, uh, the economy has really hurt us here. And uh, we want the opportunity to talk to our representatives in such a way that they can remember us as people instead of a tiny dot up there in the northeast corner. Jan Searles with the Ponderay County Democrats and John Krog organized the event. The Krogs have farmed this land for more than 100 years. They voted Democrat for just as long. Krog hosted a barbecue for Governor Christine Gregoire two years ago. This year, he invited Senator Maria Cantwell. We're anxious for her to be aware of the effort our people are making. After a brief speech, the senator walked through the bar, meeting with neighbors one-on-one. -on -one. Everything from, you know, make sure you remember our roads and infrastructure here in eastern Washington to the north-south freeway. While organizers hoped to stay clear of health care reform, it was clear the topic was too large, too heated to avoid. Two protesters greeted the senator as she arrived. I just don't believe that the government is the way to do it. Uh, the government cannot be everything to everybody. Half of the Pondray County Sheriff's Department and several Washington state troopers were standing by just in case. Senator Cantwell hopes reform will drive down out-of-pocket expenses and get uninsured on a plan. Because when they go to the emergency room, it adds to all our costs. In fact, we think it adds about $1,000 to each of our premiums on an annual basis. The senator plans to hold a more in-depth town hall forum on health care reform this fall. Reporting in Ponderay County, Annie Bishop, KXLY 4 HD News.